No, you're right, mate, um, because we'll, we'll all go together. Yeah, carry on. It, it goes on for about five or ten minutes, mate, and then you'll see this big stone archway. This massive thing, you can't you can't miss it. Yeah, it's freezing up here, mate. My hand's falling off how many, now. How many times have you told him? <laughs> Stone arch, mate. We'll, we'll see you in about five minutes or so, mate. Yeah, you can just keep on going. This stone archway, so you'll see a, you'll see a notice for a car park. Then you'll There's see a stone, a stone archway. archway. Hello, people, and welcome to another video. Me and Charlie Bizzle are up in some Welsh hills somewhere. Where are we? I don't even know where we are. Devil's Bridge. Dev De just up from Devil's Devil's Bridge. I'm not entirely sure where we are. All the signs are in Welsh. Um, and we're doing a really nice, cheeky, bothy night tonight. Lovely weather. Easy hike. We're going to go up to this bothy and we're just going to chill out. Really looking forward to it. After our ordeal with Paul Kirtley. It's a multi-storey as well. It's, it's a multi-storey body. It's not even a bothy, it's more of a cottage. <laughs> nice cottage. So we'll go and check that out. Charlie's a big fan of his bothies, aren't you, mate? Yeah, really into them. Uh, if you've not already, I've preached this all the time on my channel. Check out the Mountain Body Association. Check it out. Tons of them. I've even been on. Them. He's finally convinced me I was checking it out last night. <sighs> it's pretty cool. Uh, we've just got one more companion to wait for, the little goblin. I feel a song. He'll be here very shortly, but uh, we're going to get some lunch on the go now, I think, before we, before we start our hike. Very short hike, just a couple of miles. Um, should be nice and easy. Looking forward to it. I'm sad that we didn't get to sing. Do the goblin walk! Yeah, the goblin! <laughs> down, down, down in goblin town. <laughs> Peter's here. Hello. Peter, what brings you on this uh, epic adventure? Not you lot, I don't like you. <laughs> oh, Peter, Charlie doesn't like us. I like Charlie. Yeah. It's mostly you I don't like. Oh. Well, <laughs> unfortunate for you, you've so got to put up with me for the next two yesterday days. Yesterday at work, Ben saw a tramp and genuinely thought it was you. Ah, well. <laughs> <laughs> ah, okay, right. I don't know how to take that. <laughs> so there you go. Yeah. Hello, and welcome to the glorious Wales. I've got More a specifically, a car park near a stone archway. I'm now the official quiddle. You teach me and I'll teach you. Pokemon. Pokemon. Or the Pope. I know it's not the standing. You poke me and I'll I poke, poke you. Poke your mom. We've got some. Cheese and crackers, it's the poor curly way. Crackers. It's the poor curly way. You gotta get the fats from the cheese, mate. And the, well, traditionally they'd be oat cakes, but we've, we've swapped it out for the Jacob's up, cream. Pack style. Oh, what's that, man? That's nice. Is that your cheese knife? I actually got this. The last company I left, they got me that as a leaving present, a little summit. What? A leaving pen, present? Pen oh, like knife. the people you work with? Yeah, yeah. In the last job. Pete is just doing his admin again. Before we, before we start any trip, we have to allow at least 20 minutes for Peter to actually pack his gear. And then we'll probably get like 10 minutes down the trail and he'll repack it. You're not wrong. It's just packing that. <laughs> Look at that. What's that? Aqua Clip! <laughs> These are some black out door shots right here. Jungle Book theme going on. As we've got actual uh, real life Mowgli with us today. Random stuff. Yeah. So we've been walking for a little while now. Maybe 20 minutes if not. And uh, <clears throat> The trail is very similar to the, the bothy that we went to in Scotland. It's currently just a forestry commission trail, but uh, it's quite pleasant. The sun's coming through. A little bit of a chill in the air, so the hat and gloves are on. But uh, some lovely views of the hills currently, just through the trees there. And we're currently talking about Stanley flasks. Stanley! Stanley flasks! Stanley flasks! Silly lyrics. <laughs> what flask of four? What flask of four? Bam, 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 bam. 
and you need a brew. Who's at your side? What is, what flasks. Why does Charlie always come in with like an opera voice? What? Charlie always comes in with an opera voice. <laughs> Live, it doesn't turn into that wood. But if they, if they cut if they cut a tree down, the stump that's left, the roots are still pumping the resin into the stump. Oh. So there's shit loads of resin in the stump. And as that stump dies you can then cut it up. I don't want to. Charlie, Charlie stop starting. <laughs> Wrong camera mate. Oh god, this is the reality of <laughs> you've got your camera out, we're having a picture. <laughs> Goblin run. <laughs> Imagine if you fell down there. Charlie, why is he telling us the same story again? Never met an animal we didn't like. <laughs> Fangorn Forest. The white wizard. The white wizard approaches. Whose side am I on? I am on nobody's side, little horse, because... Nobody's no on my side. No one cares for the woods anymore. Push the trees. Tree? I am no tree. I am an ant. <laughs> this is a... This is a Lord of the Rings remake, this is... Oh my god. This is proper fan What the hell? Literally, I'm to put the it's really right dark in here. The camera's picking up alright. I'm not picking anything up. It's because you're a pussy. It's because you don't know anything. Tell me what you're doing. What? Oh. That thing's happening. Check out that view, though. I didn't realize there's a river. Sick. The this is the trouble when you come out with like people that everyone has cameras and then you all end up taking on the same photos. <laughs> oh, you look sexy! I always look sexy, mate. Look at this shot, man. If only they could see. Oh, oh I'd bomb him. I'm going to put that on my profile picture. I'd That's it. That is a good shot. <laughs> just if you've got your face in it. <laughs> Better than yours. We're really getting our harmonies together. Peter's uh, Peter's streaming live on on Facebook. Basically, what that consists of is Peter screaming at his phone while he's not looking where he's going, and us just trying to keep up. Nice little stream here. This is the river that we uh, that we could see a little bit earlier from up up top. Go go Power Rangers! Go go, go Power, Power Rangers! Rangers! Is it on? Yeah. Oh. You know, when I, uh, when I do scenes like that, I really wish I could just do like Akio camera. Be sick. Okay, the bothy is in sight, but there's also a van. We found a van, so it could already be occupied. Brian, have you? Yes, mate, have you? I have, yes. What's Charlie going to do with this somebody already in there? Basically, we're going to kill you and he's going to take your stuff. <laughs> I'm the only one with a big knife. Oh shit. <laughs> Peter, chase, fa chase Fado Shacks. Fado Shacks. Fado Shacks. Shadow Facts. Chase Fado Shacks. <laughs>
I'm sure it's not in the face. So there's definitely somebody here we've, uh, we've come to find out. So time to go and introduce ourselves. <laughs> Smoke melt the chimney. <laughs> okay, so here we are at our bothy. It's absolute chaos in there. There are about 20 kids in the one room. Um, they're, they're kind of doing some kind of cycling tour thing. And luckily they're leaving because I thought they were staying here and it was just going to be mental. They're so loud. Um, but there's some other guys as well here. Um, there's two other couples and uh, they're staying the night. So we're going to have a pretty nice social evening, which is going to be great. Um, once the crazy kids disappear. But this bothy is awesome. It's a, it's a two story. And you can actually get up to the second story. And I'll, have a, I'll, I'll probably show you around later when I can actually move around in there because it's quite busy. But um, it's absolutely luxury. There's wood. There's pro two proper stoves. Um, lots and lots of gear in there. So I'll, I'll, I'll give you a proper look around later. But um, it's sick. Yeah. And like all of them have like a different yeah. 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 Oh, look how cosy that looks. So all our visitors have left now. So I'll take you in for a, for a look around. So we've got one room in there, which we are not so accommodating. Now. Second room here. Yeah. <laughs> Fear otherwise. What are you? Do a dance. And then, uh, <laughs> oh shit, I broke something. Right, let's go upstairs. Oh my god. Right, so like I said earlier, this one's gone upstairs, and uh. Leave me alone, Peter! This is our room. Wee the goblin! Wee! Look at him go! The fucking goblin! Down, down, down to goblin, goblin town! Down, down, down in goblin town! Another room in there. It's a nice little mattress. It's not. Nice. That's where Peter's living. Oh, cheeky. This is where our friends are living in here. <laughs> You, can't, you guys won't be able to see this, but um, I'm with all the guys right now outside the Bothy and we're looking up at the sky and it is the best display of light, of stars, sorry, I've ever seen. You can see literally every single star in the sky. It's beautiful. Absolutely phenomenal. I've never seen a display like it before. I just wish the camera could pick it up, but it's beautiful. Shit, How are you feeling this morning, Brian? What? How's life with no water, Peter? What? How's life with no water? I think I'm dead. <laughs> Slightly hungover. Peter, do me a do me a, a product review. I don't really do post reviews, but if I did do post reviews, this would be a nine. Yeah. Nine Brandon. It and is proper good. Brand. I'm well impressed with it. I'm not going to use the soy mini anymore. Charlie's invested in a Hiker Pro from Catadine. Best thing about it is that you don't have to touch the water. You never have to get wet hands. Yeah. There's no risk of like contamination. Yeah. And look how fast the water's you, coming and, out. And you don't get freezing cold when you're doing it. No. Look how fast the water's coming out. It's going to start the tap. Comes out faster than my wee wee. <laughs> so 
So here we are in the inside of the box. And now it's the daylight, you can actually see around a little bit better. Pete's just sorting his admin out as usual. This Charlie's is the... Actual Charlie's writing our little... Uh... Charlie's doing the paperwork. <laughs> Got his business shoes on. So that's the main room, that's the largest room, that's the little bonus over there. This is the really weird tequila shrine that everyone needs in their bothy. And then there's actually a second room in this bothy, which is funny. It's the second room with the second fireplace. Bed there. Store back here. Firewood in there, plenty of firewood. Whoever's the volunteer at this uh, particular buffet is very good at what they do. And then, we'll go upstairs. <clears throat> There's lots of rooms upstairs. You've got a big room here. You could accommodate a lot of people in this, in this particular buffet. You've got two more rooms here. Oh, yeah. So found that there. This is where we were sleeping last night. A lot of... Uh, A lot of the bothies, if they have upstairs, they're normally closed off, but this one's obviously open and functional, which is lovely. We're about to pack up now and uh, get on the road. Daylight! So that is the final, final exit of the bothy. What bothy is it, Charlie? What? It's Nantes Sidion. Nantes Sidion. I will leave a link in the description. But it's absolutely beautiful, Bossy, and I've had an absolutely fantastic time. The company was great. We had plenty to drink, so we got a bit merry in there as well, which is lovely. It's really a great time. The stunning scenery as well. I will definitely be back here again. I think I'm going to bring Emily with me because uh, there were two couples here with us, and um, it's clearly a thing that, that it is a th clearly a thing. So I think I'll bring Emily back. I think she'll enjoy this because it's a nice little walk in as well. So, yeah, farewell. To that buffet. Amazing company. Oh, really look, he's doing what I just did. Um, and now, what, what's the bar? We're literally just heading back to the cars now. Wow, that's right. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> okay, then, folks, that is the end of our epic little micro adventure. I have thoroughly enjoyed myself. Met some fantastic folk, and I really encourage you to check out the Bothy Association website. Uh, I'll leave the link in the description um, because Charlie's definitely won me over. I really enjoy Bothy in there, um, and I, I do see a massive benefit in particularly winter hiking. Um, it gives you a good chance to get out, smash some miles, endure the hard weather, but actually have some good four walls around you at the end of the day and be able to keep warm with the stove on. Um, instead of trying to endure the hills in the middle of the winter, it's not the funniest thing to do. So yeah, um, go and check it out. And if you are going in a Bothy, please respect the Bothies and leave them better than how you found them. Um, it's the Bothy code, man. Make sure you do that shit. So, uh, until next time, thanks for watching, and I'll see you again are you not gonna sign off like very, very soon. You can drink your fancy ales, you can drink them by the flagon, we're the only proof for the brave and true. Charlie! We're the only proof for the brave and true! Cross on the green dragon! No!